New at 5 tonight, we've got your back getting answers about a DirecTV installer charged with sexually assaulting a customer in her home. It's a scary story, especially for women, and we are learning now that installer did have a criminal record. News 8's Stephanie Simone is live tonight. She has a lot more on this story. Stephanie? Darren, West Hartford police say the two did not know each other before all of this happened. Now he is behind bars being held on a $750,000 bond, and she had to go to the hospital. Police tell a terrifying tale. A woman in her 20s sexually assaulted by the man who was only supposed to install her satellite dish. Neighbors saw the aftermath. Just seen the woman coming on, get put on the ambulance. Police say 37 year old Rashford Gordon works at Eastern Video Services. They're contracted by DirecTV. Around 10 yesterday morning, police say Gordon installed the dish and. Flirting type things, apparently from the suspect. And uh, we don't know exactly what was said back, but it seems that he misconstrued what the victim was relating to him. Officers say he forced her against her will to have sex. She was obviously saying, you know, this is not, you know, no, no, et cetera. And uh, the suspect disregarded her request. She reached her sister, who called 911. Police caught up to Gordon at his next install appointment. He does have a criminal history. In 2013, Gordon was charged with domestic crimes like threatening and breach of peace, but he's never been convicted of a crime. You don't hear stories like this. You know, a cable guy comes and rape a woman. It's, it's, you don't hear that a lot. Eastern Video Services did not answer the door or return our phone calls. Direct TV sent a statement saying safety is the utmost importance and we, quote, require all of our contractors to conduct extensive background and chemical screening tests. This individual contractor completed the background check process and passed. Police say he's never had a complaint filed against him, but did admit to having sex with another customer on a job and dating women who are customers. I wish her well. I wish she recuperate, and I know it's sad, you know, to get raped like that, but I hope she recuperate, and it's a sad story. Now, police say if you have any stranger come over for any sort of reason, it's always good to have a second person there. And of course, if anything suspicious starts to happen, call 911. We'll have much more on this story coming up at 6 o'clock. Live in Hartford tonight, Stephanie Simone, News 8.